They even give you a uh, free tea. Yeah, that's the tea's good. Yeah. Yeah. No sugar, just the way I like it. I like that the noodles are handmade back there instead of like the package. The broth is like a I guess beef and chicken. Very good. The broth is the best part. <laughs> Comes with scallions. Okay. Oh, sorry. Arugula. Huh. They're supposed to come with seaweed, but it doesn't look like they have any this time. Probably because it's closing and they ran out. Definitely gonna miss this place. Mm. The pork's amazing. Mm. So good. The perfect mix of broth, noodles, pork. So good. Way ton, hundred times better than the package. You gotta try it real hard. So good. Now we're going to try the tonkotsu. This is a different ramen. So this is a pork based broth. It's got the same pork belly. Same great noodles. This one has, I think these are water mushrooms. Very good. I like the other one better though, but they're both very good. And that place over there literally has the best ramen in New York City. It's sad to see that it's going out of business. Oh man, that was like the best ramen. Uh, I remember when I first started working around here, you could get a uh, bowl for $8, and now at the closing it's $14 a bowl. Pretty crazy. The prices just keep going up and up. So uh, maybe that's why they're going out of business. I don't know. This area sucks. And uh, it's the only good food in the area. So it's pretty crazy. The tonkotsu. Uh, Show you ramen is amazing. We gotta go back and try it. Definitely gotta have it at least one more time before they go out of business. So I had to do this food Fridays. We'll have to find out what now is going to be the next best ramen in New York City. But that ramen is so so good. If you liked this video, make sure to comment, rate, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.